Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay, I can hear you really well through my headphones. Yeah, I think I can hear you as well. Okay, so we should be good. All right, so Dan takes game one. Uh, Dan has put everyone in this tournament on notice. Uh, he just told me if he wins this tournament, everyone here is awful and they should quit. Anyway. <laughs> All right, well, now we know. <laughs> right. You heard it here first. Ooh, that, I'm not sure if that was like the world's greatest. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened with that up air. So uh, what I'm wondering, so game one uh, was a pretty convincing three stock uh, right. or the first stock Dan kind of just dropped a lot of easy openings from what I saw but he cleaned it up and I mean he basically killed him off every opening he had the rest of the game so I'm wondering if this is what he believes to be the best counter pick or if he's just picking DK because he fucked him up so bad game one uh, no I think I think it's both okay. um, I think I think if this were Kells he would make the same pick in fact he does make the same pick when he plays Kells interesting I just think he believes that because of his DK history and because of this character and the chain grabs, yeah. that really, like, this is a winnable matchup on this stage against this character. Yeah, I mean, he's making it look winnable, that's for damn sure. Yes, he is. I mean, it's it's really tough to play this matchup. Uh, not, I don't want to say it's tough to play this Fox, because obviously Fox wins this matchup, but it's scary. It's super scary, because, like... You get grabbed once. You, you get grabbed once, you die, and you want to laser camp, but at the same time, I mean, you have oh to be God. very, very careful laser camping against somebody like DFU, because... Right. Obviously, he is... He'll recognize bad spacing. Yeah, so oh, if, you're, if you're trying to laser camp in a space such that he can actually hit you when you think you're you're okay, like, he'll absolutely do that. Absolutely. Well, All right, so Spence really <laughs> would like to actually get a kill here. Yeah, and he taunted and then dropped the edge guard, which isn't the best look, but no, no. <laughs> hopefully he'll get one. Uh, but, I mean, again, if he gets grabbed once, that could be the end of the game. Yeah, it's pretty demoralizing when yeah. this happens to you. Honestly, I, I feel like, I mean, just in my own personal experience, some of the kill setups on DK are really, really odd as Fox. Like, I mean, up throw up air feels like a kind of a weird timing to hit. And yeah. then at the same time, like, if you want to go up throw back air, I mean, his horizontal recovery is clearly much, much better than his vertical, right. the vertical recovery. And so it has invincibility in those first few frames. It, exactly. So you can't get too close to him. Exactly. Interesting. And yep, yeah, that's, that's it. it. <laughs> well, that's it's unfortunate. The needle cancel. <laughs> yeah. I guess all the tech just carries over, and then it's just easy, right? Yeah, of course. That's got to be how it works. <laughs> so now we get a. Now